Hello everybody, I'm going to show you guys how to use Quarry Plus from the Quarry Plus mod. Um, this system right here is just to illustrate, it's just a Applied Energistics ME system with two full drives of 64k storages. Alright, so let's get all this stuff out. Alright, so the Quarry Plus, you, you just place it and it does its usual thing. You can also put a Pump Plus on top of it to pull out any liquids. Let's just fill an area with water real quick and put that there because why not? Uh, water. There it is. There we go. Sources everywhere. All right. Before I connect that, let's. Uh, I when using the Quarry Plus, it pulls out items extremely quickly, so I like to use the transfer node with the, the transfer pipes right there. And then let's stick half a stack of each of those in there. That will make it go pretty quickly. All right, let's connect her up. Got to that water, sucked it all up at once. So yeah, it's just going to keep doing that. Then, if we use this item right here, we will see that, hey, it has 20 millibuckets of water. Um, we'll get back to that in a second. But for now, you can see it's uh, grabbing all those. Go over here, switch that to stack mode because it was falling a bit behind. There we go. You can do it that way. I believe you can also directly connect it with the precision import. Does not look like it works with the direct signal from the precision import. Alright, well, I was wrong on that. So there we go. And dirt's going up. Alright, so that's that. Now, the water uh, that's in the pump, you may be wondering why I'm not just, you know, pumping it out with a fluid duct or whatever. The problem with the Quarry Plus Pump Plus um, pump is it tries to empty out all of its fluids in a single go. And there's only one uh, mod that I know that will accept an unlimited amount of fluids at any single time. So let's just get rid of all that real quick. Now let's find the translocator for liquids. And a drum. Because that will accept plenty of fluids. Now you just put it there, put it there. Now it won't transfer anything until you have this little center area pushed in. Then it will do it. Um, all right. Hold on one second. Quarry plus. Grab the status checker. I believe since we didn't have anything connected originally, all the liquids just got deleted. So let's grab some more liquids. And... Break that off. That should be a fair amount of liquid. Alright. Status checker. 67 millibuckets of liquids. Alright. Place that down. And hey, look at 67 um, buckets of water was instantly transferred from the pump plus to the drum. Alright, so that is how that works with the pump plus. Now the next part about this mod that you probably want to 
know about is the enchantment mover. Normally, if you weren't in creative, you would have to have a diamond pick over there with one of these four enchantments. You can then, but since I'm in creative, I can just stick the quarry in there. Now you click each of these once and, you know, it gives you efficiency one all the way up to efficiency five. Each rank of efficiency decreases the power draw that is needed to mon run at maximum efficiency. Um, fortune will apply the fortune effect to blocks that are applicable. Silk touch will apply the silk touch. And I am unsure what unbreaking does, but I'm sure it does something. So that is the enchantment mover. So that's all for this quick tutorial on Quarry Plus. Thanks. Bye-bye now.